My name is Mike and we're at Highland Hill Farm. Today we're going to start a restoration on an old antique Massey Harris 1953 pony tractor. You go inside and take a look. Tim? Yes? Tell people what you're going to do and about the tractor. Well, first off, this tractor's been studying for a number of years. We understand it's been over 25. And we're going to start with checking everything out first before we do anything. We have to check the water, check the oil level. We want to lubricate the engine and other necessary things. So first I have to do is remove the hood to get to the engine on this little... This is the Massey Harris tractor. We're going to do a test to see if it turns over. We put the new battery on. All we do now is just put the terminal on. We should be able to see if it fires. So, it's hooked on. Okay. We, we don't have any gas in it, correct? No, no gas in it. Just the turnover. Okay. Turn the key on, and this is the starter. And it will... Well, it turns well. Turn over. I wonder if it has spark. We'll try it. Ready? Yes. We just wanted to separate somewhere. Do we have to remove that because there's material from the old gasket in there yet. And there's a very fine screen that we have to be careful we won't damage. float in there yes but right now you got so much residue bonding it oh yeah yep, there you go that's keep going the way you're doing that's perfect uh, yeah you want my surgeon's coat <laughs> operations oh. i'm still dragging <laughs> oh man Right in the ground. <laughs> well, what? They're off the school. Yes, well, see, I got the real little one that's only four months old. Oh, my goodness, that's right. Yeah, I'm not allowed to change diapers here. <laughs> <laughs> the mother's. Yeah, she does food research. She's a doctor of research. So she reads them on everything. Yeah. And she can't eat anything because it goes through the baby. Okay. The baby's going to be. You put it right on this thing? Okay, right take it out. Take it off. We put it right on here? No, you gotta take it off. Okay, we got the little pony started today. We had a series of little setbacks, but we've got it now. We had a gasket leaking around the little sediment bowl. Michael, the owner of this tractor, went and made one out of a piece of rubber. That's part of this job. Do what you can. So then we had a couple other little leaks. Salt. And then we start crank it over. Can well, you can you crank it up for us? Well, we can do it now. Yes, we'll give it a try. Okay, we got to put the cable on the battery. Yes, is... Joe, you go ahead and take care of that. I'm kind of hung up here, busy. I have to open the fuel stopcock or no? no. Start it right up. any old equipment for trees or for farming, just let us know. We'll be interested in buying it. We use it on our farm here to grow trees and shrubs at Highlands Hill Farm. If you'd like to support us, you can give us a call and ask what we have available. Our number is 215-651-8329. It's during the winter months that we get time to rework and rebuild old antique farm equipment that we have here on the farm. During the winter months, we do a lot of trading and bartering to get things such as PVC pipe and fittings because we use quite a bit of it throughout the year, building drain lines for our fields and also putting in water lines to deliver water to areas where we need it in the nursery. It's a shame when people throw out PVC, but they do throw it out. People throw out large amounts of pipe and fittings because they're no longer using it, and it can be put to good use on our nursery.
So we will go pick it up, whether it's a couple pieces or a whole truckload. Just give us a call at Highland Hill Farm. We're at 215-651-8329. Thank you. Give us a call at Highland Hill Farm for your trees and shrubs. 215-651-8329. We ship from Fountainville, PA, Milan, PA, Lenore, North Carolina, and McNinville, Tennessee. Thank you.